Hi, I'm Art and Zero EX. Thanks for finding my YouTube channel, RDF Fun, on all things related to amateur radio direction finding. Today I want to talk a little bit about a transmit controller. This is a fox hunt transmitter controller that I have designed and built and I'm offering for sale that is specifically set up to interface to Baofeng handhelds or their equivalent that use the their standard 2.5 millimeter, 3.5 millimeter mic um, audio interface. So this controller is uh, dip switch controlled. All the options are shown right here on the front panel. Uh, what each dip switching controls is shown here on the back. So there's no uh, having to program this. Uh, set your dip switches, hook it up to your transceiver, and you're off and running. 9 volt battery fits right in here so this is all you got. Hook this to your ball fang. So there is a lot of other options out there for transmit controllers. Uh, there's uh, some you can go out and find some schematics and plans. A lot of them are Arduino controllers that you would build up and program that you can wire up themselves. So if you're comfortable with programming and building off of an Arduino you can you can certainly figure out how to make your own. If you're looking for something to, uh, to buy, there's a, uh, there's a Bionics is out there. They have several controllers to pick from. Uh, there's our programmable. There's, there's will allow you more options. Um, so this is an alternative to their stuff that's, that's simpler. You don't have to hook up to uh, your PC to program. Uh, this has essentially preset, presets that you would select with the uh, dip switches on front. So this is about a three inch by two inch package. It's a little bit bigger than that. Uh, there's a temperature comp temperature compensated crystal oscillator in here. So it's very accurate in timing. You're gonna lose less than a half a second uh, per day. And a typical fox hunt's only gonna go a few hours. So you're gonna be right on time. It's very easy to set uh, several of these up um, and alternate minutes or you know alternate if if they transmit for 30 seconds every minute you can uh, trigger this uh, turn the next one on 30 seconds later and they're just going to alternate 30 seconds 30 seconds 30 seconds one will be transmitting so again powered by a 9 volt battery that fits right in here all the details you need for the for the setting of the dip switches is shown right on the front and back so let me do a quick hook up here and uh, I'm going to hook it up to the to my ball fang here and just flip it on. Right now it's set for it to come on with no delay and hopefully you can hear the uh, Morse code that it's sending. It's The red LED is going to be on here in front when it transmits. After every transmission it's going to send the pre-programmed user um, ID, your, your license. I will program that in here before delivery for you. And uh, it's gonna, then it's going to go into standby. The LED is going to blink about once every three seconds. And then it's going to repeat the cycle. So um, you can set uh, different start delays. You can set different run times. You can set different loop times. And then there's eight different messages that you can set it up to send with all with just dip switch selections. So if you want more information on this, uh, go to go to qrz.com and type in my call sign, which is N0EX, and I'm going to have uh, more information on this and availability and price, and my email's on there. You can send me any questions um, with any information about it. So also feel free to uh, comment down below and uh, like and share this page. I appreciate that, and uh, good luck with your fox hunting. Thanks for stopping by.